What if you could focus on your happiest memories? Make them brighter, more vivid. Meet Oobly. Oobly uses neuroscience to strengthen your happiest memories. With one tap, you can experience the greatest moments of your life. Whenever and wherever. Remember what matters. I came home to tell my mom, and she started crying because she was so happy. And I, I remember it so well, I could hear what was on the radio. And I could smell her clothes. But I was there. I was there. Your father, Mr. Clay, you're a genius, for real. And how about afterwards? How did you feel? Inspired and energized, like when the power company turned your lights back on. 
When Oobly gave me that memory, it gave me back this truth about myself that I could do anything if I put my mind to it. And life tried to make me forget that. That's what Oobly does. It makes you remember the best of yourself. That's all you, Crystal. The Oobly is just an amplifier. Your memories, your joy, your power. I love this woman. <laughs> Thank you. Um, what Crystal shared just now reminded me of how I felt many years ago when I was also very alone. Fifteen years ago, my mother took her life. And it was a complete shock. The last time I saw her, she was happy. And then she was just gone. And for a while, her leaving began to define me. It made no sense. And I also went to a very dark place. And it was my father who pulled me out. He taught me that I could choose to remember my mother with sadness or I could choose to remember her as a warm and loving presence in my life. And that is the choice I have made every day since then. That's the important truth. This is what the Oobly is about. By changing your mind, you change everything. Did you get what you needed? What do you mean? Your footage. Oh, I think so. What did you think? You're the marketing expert. That's your call. I thought we had some great stories. Why did you tell them? About Mom? I was... It was moving, what they were saying. I wanted to be with them. I understand. It's a great pitch. Empathy. You can't get more authentic than that. Exactly. Sophie, I know you don't like to hear it. But we wouldn't be here without you. You sell it better than any of us ever could. I mean that. Thank you. You want to ride back with me, sit in on my interview? I have an appointment. Celebrating with girlfriends. Well deserved. I'll see you afterwards then. Dad? We're going to change the world, aren't we? Yes, we are.
Sophie, it's beautiful. Sophie, it's beautiful. You know what? You're crazy. Hey, you walk. Mind your own business, hey. buddy. You ready to go home? The Ubli launch is just two days away. Are you worried? <laughs> no. Well, many analysts are skeptical about your projections. They say you should stick to medical research and that your consumer marketing team are inexperienced. Some of those naysayers, frankly, are showing a real bias. Sophie Clay is my daughter, but she also happens to be one of the best marketers in the industry, full stop. That must be a great deal of pressure for her then, no? Excuse me? Is she the one carrying the show? The Oubli is a revolutionary device. You've tried. You've been delighted by it. That's the show. How's your brother? He's good. You find a job yet? Not yet, but he's still looking. You know, we could find something for oh, him. Thank you, but uh, he needs to find something on his own. Why? We'd be happy to. The only way that he's gonna make it is if you feel some pain right now. He needs some growing up pain. Oh, you're a shitty brother. Spoken like an only child. to bypass regulation by classifying the oubli as a non-medical device, yet your own research shows that some subjects experienced memory loss. No, that's not oh, the yes, data. it's in your own SEC filing. Subjects experience difficulties recalling memories associated with stress or painful... The very next sentence, as you know, is that when they stopped using the oubli, their memories came back. So, it's a personal choice. If you want to experience the focus, the joy, the inspiration, the oubli is for you. If you don't, you don't.
then give us the code. What code? The code for the implant. If you hurt her, you'll get nothing. We won't if you give us the code. You can't use the code on her. On who? Your daughter? I want to talk to her. I understand you. Do you have a brain implant? What? What do you want? What is this? What do you mean? Can you get the code for the implant? Just, just call my father. He'll give you whatever you want. No, just, just wait, 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 no! my girl I can describe one of them a girl and and the room you already did we have all that our guys are tearing the place apart they have suspects I'm sorry 
You have nothing to be sorry about. I thought I was going to die. You're doing great. I am so proud of you. What did they want? Nothing. They didn't make any sense. She was on drugs. Yes, probably. What did she do to me? Nothing. Small cut. Dr. Siespi's checked you out. He said you're perfectly fine. You are one tough cookie. You know that? So let me look here. Any pain here? A little. Or here? No. Good. I gave you something to help you relax. You'll feel a little groggy, but otherwise you'll be 100% by tomorrow. The launch. Don't worry about that. You can't push it back. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> We're not going to push it back. Now, please, focus on getting some rest. My phone. Do you want me to postpone the launch? No. Then rest. Try to let the sedatives help you get back to sleep. Take care of yourself, Sophie. Doctor's orders. I will do anything for you, you know that, right? I know. Then do this for me. I don't want any negative thoughts. This is a moment of joy for us. You understand? I'll see you in a few hours. something else. A glitch? A no. The chlorine from the pool. The breeze changed.
don't make mistakes. The next few days are very important for us. Will you help me? Always. You've always been there for me. I don't want anything to change. Promise. I promise. Thank you. So much for resting. How are you feeling? All right. No pain? No. Just a little shaken. Oh, my God. Of course. I don't think I'd be up and about if I were you. Two days to launch. Two days to launch. This crashed this morning. There was a loud noise, and then it just stopped working. Well, that's no good. Let me see. There were glitches as well. Visual? Auditory? Yeah. Ghosting. Weird artifacts. Could it be the sedatives? Possible. Have you seen your father? Not yet. He's giving a press tour. Did you get this one from his house? Mm -hmm. That's what it is. It's a demo model. Here, take one of these. And thanks for coming directly to me. If anything else happens, if you experience anything out of the ordinary, you come back to me, okay? Sophie? Your father won't ever tell you, but he was very scared. We're all very proud of you. Thank you. Ready for the spotlight? Yes, I am. told you. Of course. We're worried about you. Are you sure you're up to this? Positive. How are you feeling? I'm good. I'm fine. How are the press tours going? Great. Coached by the best. Any news? I don't want you to worry about that. We're handling it. Why don't we have lunch? I've got a few minutes now. I'm going to the edit bay to finish the tape. That's taken care of. No. That's my job. I'm going to finish it. Sophie? Yes? Save your energy for the launch. I'm doing both. OK. I'll stop by in a bit, then. I can do this. I know you can. I love you. Love you, too. When that's what Oobly does, it gives you the best of yourself. Oobly. Remember oh, what Slide matters. that back so the line comes in with the music change. And that's the way it was. So you want to go back to what we had before? Yes, thank you. OK. You got it. Anything else? No, that's it. When that's what Oobly does, it gives you the best of yourself. Oobly. Remember what matters. As I traveled around the country so, gathering stories, uh, what comes after that in the crystal tape? It does. It gives you the best of yourself. Mm, that's all you, Crystal. OK, fast forward, please. Play from there. 
15 years ago, my mother took her life. And it was a complete shock. The last time I saw her, she was so happy. And then she was just gone. What was that? Gone. What? The, the image that just flashed. Oh, I didn't see anything, one sec. The last time I saw her, she was so happy. And then she was just gone. And for a while, her leaving began to define me. It made no sense. And I was in a very dark place. And it was my father who pulled me out. Sophie, could you excuse us, please? How was the press tour? Sophie, you have to stop. I'm almost done. I saw what just happened. You jumped out of your chair. My eyes are tired. What's this about? What are you looking for? It's okay. You can tell me. I think they did something to me. Something's wrong. We ran every test. You're fine. I know it was a horrible shock, but you have to go home and rest. I can't remember the last time I saw Mom. I can't. Dad. I saw... What did you see? Blood. So much blood, and... and, and there was this... Sound. It... Were you using the oubli? Were you using the oubli when you had these hallucinations? Sophie, I know what's going on. I looked at your oubli history. You're using it too much. You shouldn't have done that. Sophie, I miss her, too. Not like I do. It's not the same. All I want is for you to be happy, for you to be your own person. And right now, that means letting go. You have to let her rest in peace. From Dr. C.S.B. Why? For anxiety. Your prescription. I'm not anxious. Just for the next few days. The tape is basically done. You need to rest and be ready to present. Sophie, I know you. I know how much you want the launch to be a success, and it will be if you let me help you. Trust me. She would be so proud of you right now. You know that, don't you? Now, please, take one.
What's wrong? Thank you. Taking any new medications right now? Something for anxiety. I've been taking it for long? No. Any complications before from the implant? What? Your implant. For epilepsy, right? I don't have an implant. Any problems with memory? I have to go. Oh, hang on. I'd like to keep you for observation no. until my neurologist no, gets here. No, I'm not here staying here. She tore up the baggage. She wouldn't have been Sorry. Please go away. Did they show you the implant? Your company did that. No. You're lying. You put one inside me too. And you injected me with something. You're trying to make me crazy. Is that what your father said? Get off me! Get! Do you want me to make it stop? I can do that. Put this into your father's computer, and then I'll make it stop. I'm trying to destroy us. All I want is the code for the chip that you implanted inside of me. Get it for me, and then I'll fix what I did to yours. And then you'll never see me again. I am very disappointed in you. Do you understand me? Bring her home now. Yes, sir. Right away. Sophie. Sophie. She's going to remember. No, she's not. Because she doesn't want to. It's a big risk. If they know about Sophie's implant, if they know about the research, if they leak it to the press or anyone, we're done. It's over. No. All anyone's going to care about is the product. Does it work? Will it make me happy? And it does. And it will. Could it be Elizabeth? She tried before. She doesn't talk to anyone. She doesn't see anyone. I made sure of that. Well, it wasn't me. What about Aiden? Why don't you go and get some rest? Take some pills or whatever it is you do. You've done enough for today. Sophie, this is Elizabeth. She's going to help us. Hello, Sophie. It's nice to meet you. How are you feeling? I'm fine. Thank you. Do you need more time? No. I'm ready. She took my hand that day. There's nothing there now. 
The temperature is right, but it doesn't feel like her. Okay. Hold. Hold. Oh. There she is. Hi, Mom. Sophie, did you sleep well? Fine. I went to the hospital last night to see another doctor. That's great. You feel any better? Don't you want to know why I went? What they told me? Oh, perfect. We can get you both. No, I'm sorry. It's just me. We're in a conference room. Oh, it, it'll be so much better with you, Sophie. Are, are you sure you can't? I can. Wonderful. <laughs> I'll see you both in there. When we last spoke, you said it was up to the consumer to decide whether or not losing memories... That's incorrect. They're never lost. We talked about this before the interview. We're not discussing this again. Well, yes, but I have a follow-up. I've answered the question. Sophie, let's talk about marketing. In your teaser campaign, you described the Oobly as a device for creating happiness. So, has the Oobly made you happier? Yes. So you were betting that the consumer would rather be happier than healthier or smarter? Both and. Happier is healthier. Health is smart. Is this because it's not a tested medical device? Is, is that why? It has been tested extensively. So with this very vague promise, why should the consumer trust you? I mean, you're, you're asking them to mess about with their memories. I mean, you say it will... Enhance their memories. Make them vivid, bright, tangible. In fact, you're just asking the same question again. Let's move on. So basically, you're saying, trust us with your memories. Yes, of course. Why? What's that? Why should they trust you? Is that a question for me? Why should they trust you? That's a very good question. I think what Sophie is reminding us is that we've spent 15 years developing the technologies inside the Oobly. The chip alone has gone through over a hundred iterations, all told involving a, a billion dollars in investments. Ask me what they showed me at the hospital last night. Ask me. This is the fun of working with family. We work together, we play together. 
They were very competitive with one another. Last night, Sophie toured a facility that something. It's a family affair, so if you're no, gonna... He doesn't care what's happening to me. She can help me. They tried to kill you. She could have, but she didn't. Aiden, I'm in pain. Please. What is it that they want from you, Sophie? She wants the code to the implant. She says that, that, that we put it there in her head. She says it's the same one he put in my head. You're the only person I can ask. Will you help me get the code? Aiden, you are the only person I can trust. Do you understand that? Then just, just get it from me right now. Just go upstairs. It's not upstairs. Then take me where it is. Call your father. Tell him I'm taking you home. Tell him you're feeling better. Tell him you're sorry. Where are you? I'm gonna go home. Aiden's gonna take me there now, to my apartment. That sounds like a very good idea. I took the pills. You were right. I'm sorry. I feel much better now. Fantastic. Bye. Goodbye. What are you doing? I'm getting what you want right now. So do it. We need to meet. No, I don't. You're alone, aren't you? Well, so am I. Call me in an hour.
Come step outside and walk away from the car. She wants you to step outside. That's not gonna happen. Aiden, trust me. Open the door, Aiden. Keep walking. Why is he here? He knows where it is. Make him tell you. This is the only way. He's going to take us. Open the door on your right and get out of the car. Why? You're coming with me. We'll follow him. Sophie! Get back in the car! Sophie! you up to a sensor. To do what? To see if the chip inside your head was the same as mine. How do you even know how to do that? Three years ago, I started seeing things. I went to a doctor and they found this thing inside my head. They didn't know what it was or who put it there. My family had no idea. They adopted me when I was little. And after two years of looking, I found this. This is what's inside us. There was enough code on it for me to find out who made it. For me to find you. The one inside my head is shutting down. And if I don't make it stop, I'm going to die. Who is she? Her name is Elizabeth. She can give you what you need. Does she work for my father? She used to. Did you design an implant for my father? Does he know you're here? Does he know she's here? I need the code for the implant. Who are you? She's dying because of what you and my father did to her. Do you want me to help you? Where did you find her? Do you know how it works? Yes. Then help me fix it. 
What makes you think it is broken? Because it's shutting down. You should have done that 15 years ago. Then get it out of me. It doesn't come out. Fix it! Uh, I can't. Fix it! It cannot be fixed! What about mine? What about it? Is it going to kill me too? Of course not. Yours lasts forever. Oh. That's right. Wait. We can go to my father. I, I can make him help you. I already tried that. Why don't you stay here with me? I'd like to know more about you. I have some equipment here. I can take a look. It will be painless, I promise. No. What did you do to her? Tell me what you did to her! I ran tests, that's what I did. Research and development. You experimented on her. She was one of many subjects, yes. How many were there? few hundred. All of them children? Yes. It was all legal and paid for. You disgust me. And it's okay you don't remember what I've done for you. I didn't ask for any of this. Where do you think the ugly came from? That's right. The implant. Yes. Yes. She's fine. She's just sleeping. I have something else for you. And my father put one in my head? Why? So you could remember what matters. Go to Elizabeth. Bring all her files to me. What about Elizabeth? That's taken care of. I already sent someone for her. Sophie, we have to go. Your father sent someone for her. My gun. did you know? <laughs> Sophie. Is that why you're helping me? Because you feel guilty? Sophie! Get in the car and close the door. Right there! Cover her. Please. Sophie, get in the car. Drop it. Drop it. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I'll take you where you want to go. They find you, they find us all. That's not gonna happen. Let's go. can't stop here. I need to get out. I need to get out right now. I 
don't think I can make it. It's not safe here. Where's it safe for me? Let her go. She's in pain. Leave her be. Soon. start at the beginning? Yes. Sophie, sorry to interrupt, but you have a visitor. Hi, Sophie. Hi, Dad. So, how is it? <laughs> it's perfect. Are you all right? I'll be right back. Sophie, get out of here! Go of her. Stay away from her! Come here! Please. No! Stop! No. Stop! Stop. Stop. Not leave Don't her. you dare Stop. touch her! Shut up, you Don't stupid do bitch! Oh, Sophie, get out of here! Get out! Right now!
Sophie. You're gonna get hurt in there. I don't care. I'm telling everyone what he did. You're gonna regret this. How dare you? Thank you, Aiden. Can you give us a minute? No, stay. I just wanted you to know I was ready. I dropped by your house this morning. Um, I stayed at a hotel. Security made me nervous. Everything is going to be fine now. You've been through so much. You're so strong. You feeling all right? Just nervous. Why? It's a big day. Don't be. We've moved things around. You don't have to present. I am presenting. You join us on stage with the whole team. That's the message we need to communicate today. This is who we are. This is what we stand for. You approve? I'll see you on stage. Sophie. We're going to change the world. the lightest, the fastest, the most versatile microchip ever made. Over Sophie. 100 iterations, You're a billion here. dollars in investments, over one billion transistors on every chip. But then we made it better by making it affordable. The best technology that money can buy won't just be for the Where's very few, phone? only just for the privileged. Sorry. Hurry up. But for hundreds of millions of consumers around the world. There's a lot of people out there. You don't need to do this. Personal technology. You can leave right now promise. and everything will be fine. A promise that no, technology I'm can make us it. better. I'm can we combine it. art and science to help Sorry. people remember not just an appointment or an event, You check the script. You don't need a microphone. To remember the okay. best of who they really are when they're at their best. That's what the Oobly does. It's done it for thousands in our beta program, and starting today, it will do that for millions. It's not now? Teachers, Are you sure? artists, students, families, okay. everyone. Sorry. Well, we could have stopped there, and it would have been a tremendous breakthrough. But we kept going, because the true measure of success is not how many units we shift, how many lives would change. That's the, that's the team we've assembled. I'd like to bring them on stage now, starting with Sophie Clay. Thank you. Thank you. I, wow. Wow. My father has been working on this for, what, 10 years, 15? How many years has it been? About that many. And the Oobly really is an incredible thing. And in all this time, I never once thought to ask you one question, which I would like to ask you now. After you killed my mother, were you sorry? The microphone is off. As I traveled around the country gathering stories from our testers, one word came up again and again, joy. Not because of something the Oobly had done, done but because of something they had done. The joy of a first right, kiss. The joy of overcoming a great no. obstacle. 
Because the oubli is about joy, the personal freedom joyful memories create. I know what you did, Elizabeth. The implant, the children. So does Aiden. Does he now? You killed her. You have no idea what I've done for you. I've died a hundred times so you could live your own life. You killed my mother. Just shut up! I have tried so hard to help you, to cut the selfishness out of you, but I just couldn't cut deep enough. You should have killed me too. You're embarrassing yourself. I remember it all. Oh? I hate you. What do you remember, Sophie? Hmm? That I killed her? Is that what you want? You're fighting. You're fighting and you shoved her and, and, and you took me away from her. No, Sophie, you're protecting yourself. No, you're lying. Oh, Sophie, you've exhausted me. I want to leave. Let me out right now! All right, I will. But first, I need you to make an informed choice. You need to know what you almost did just now, what you were about to destroy. You think I've done all this for myself? No. I've done all this for you. This is what I remember, so you don't have to. You were out of control. You didn't care about me or your mother. Shut up, shut up! But you couldn't take this one back. Sophie, come here! Let go! It almost killed you. <laughs> Let her go! Sophie, please, Don't, come here! Stop! I, I, Stop I hate it! You, I hate you! Get out right now. We all did what we had to do to protect you. Then you made a choice, Sophie. You chose to change. And you can do that again right now. You can choose to walk out of here and become the person who did that, the person who killed their own mother, or you can stay with me and be who you were meant to be. A brilliant, caring person who helps other people, millions of people. You can give them a second chance. You can give them what you have, a choice. So, who do you want to be, Sophie? I'm the only one who really loves you. Remember that. to me in my darkest hour. That memory that 
Ubli gave me gave me a truth about myself that I could do anything if I if I put my mind to it. And life was trying to make me forget that. And that's what Ubli does. It gives you the best of yourself. Ten million, Sophie. Ten <laughs> million. I know. It's incredible. We'll get used to it. How does it feel? Amazing. Scary, but amazing. You know this is just the beginning. You're going to expect more, better, cheaper, faster. Mm, I know. But not today, OK? Are you okay? Yeah. It's such a beautiful day today. It's just... Just? It's like the last time I saw Mom. It's a day just like today. She would be so proud of you. You know. Thank you.